what's up beautiful people welcome back to my channel if you guys are new here my name is Latish. now guys this is future me jumping in because past me forgot to record an intro at least i thought i recorded an intro but you know what i'm getting up there in age okay so everything is allowed i'm knocking on 40s door so if i forget to do something here and there that's okay okay darling that's my story and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> Anyways, guys, we're going to be doing a bedroom update. I am installing. We finally got some curtains. And you guys know if you are my OGs, the bedroom makeover has been posted and we still, we still did not have curtains. Okay. So we finally got us some curtains and I will play the video in a minute so I wouldn't have to be talking so much. But I hope you guys enjoy. Like comment subscribe if you have not as yet share this video click that notification bell so you're notified every time i upload and i will see you guys in my next one okay so let's start off with the tiniest items that i got and all the items so window treatments they're from ikea i'm going to do my best to link them down in the description box below for you guys if i can find links to them but this is literally a um non so sticky what do you call these these are called uh hemp tapes this is a hemp tape and it's called design henrik perutz i can't really i don't know if you guys can see that but i can't really pronounce the last one sy design tape so that's what it is and i bought this for i want to say a euro 15 it wasn't Y'all, it is, what, 10 meters of tape, and it was for a euro something. It wasn't expensive at all. All of, Just about all of these items weren't expensive. This is the little curtain, and I bought four of these. One is for our bedroom, the master bedroom. One is for the guest bedroom, and two are for the makeover for the patio. I know you guys are waiting on that patio just please bear with us until we can get some better weather. <laughs> so I bought these little curtains for four euros. And these look very sheer, very weather resistant. And I really wanted something sheer for when I want um, to open the main part of the curtain for some light to also be able to come through and still have some privacy uh, against the windows and... I thought that, you know, these were very inexpensive, so why not buy some for the inside of the bedrooms? If I don't like them, I can just take them down, you know what, and use it for somewhere else in the house. So I bought four of these for four euros a piece. I also got these Linda curtains. This is for 28 euros. This was the most expensive thing that I bought. This was with for 28 euros and I saw this on a YouTuber's channel by the name of Glamorous Wildflower. She is an amazing YouTuber. She also does home decor. She just bought her new home and she is very funny. She is very nice to watch, very good to hang out with. So if you guys want to go ahead and check out her channel, definitely do that. But I saw these on her channel and they looked like very good quality. They have that like linen texture. And this is in the color off-white, I think. It's not exactly white, but it's the off-white kind of uh, color. And I thought that would be good for the room because my bedroom is basically black and white. <laughs> okay. And I didn't want any colors to like be right in my face. I also bought... A curtain rod and this was for can't remember under 10 euros this was for under 10 euros I know it wasn't very expensive and what was so weird about it is the site had a bunch of the same length because this is how long is this yeah 120 by 210 yeah and a lot of these were the same length for different prices which was weird this was the cheapest one for nine something and they went up as high as 20 something euros which was weird because they were the exact same thing but yeah i got the cheapest one because it didn't make sense buying the most expensive one and it was the exact same thing and this actually has a double um holder for the rods 
because I want two curtains up and I didn't want to like put up two sets of rods so that is why I bought that one because the one that we had previously only had um, a holder for a single curtain and I just didn't want to spray paint that or do whatever to it because it's very nice wooden um, hangers curtain hangers and I didn't want to mess those up I'll keep them for something later or something else and last but not least this is one of the planters that um, we bought for the patio but I got this from Globus and it's a I don't know if it's plastic I don't know but it's a very nice it looks really really nice guys and it looks like good quality and we bought these for like 17 something I can't remember the exact price but this was for under 18 euros it was 17 something and we bought two of them and it's like a plastic you know it's light okay <laughs> it's light so yeah we bought two of these because I love the design of it and it was inexpensive and it gives that almost like clay look and honey we are on a budget okay we're on a budget and you can achieve a lot by not spending a lot having said that let's get in to these windows okay <laughs> so just a heads up guys these curtain rods um be crafter be crafter Crypto curtain rods they do not come with screws or the little butterfly hooks that go into the van I mean goes into the wall um, so if you guys do buy these you're gonna to have to go and purchase the screws because they're not included and this manual also does not say the size of the screw which doesn't really help you doesn't make sense only because my husband actually has a screw kit or a nail kit that uh, my father-in-law and you know kept at the house before he passed away that's the only reason why we actually have these on hand if not you're gonna have to take one of the um, hooks out or the thing that goes into the wall you're gonna have to take this with you and get it get the screw measured to see if it actually fits it so ikea if you guys are watching put the size screws inside the manual if it's not included in the kit please that would help us very well very much as customers you know just help us out a little bit you know what i'm saying you make it easy but you know at least don't let us guess the size screws <laughs> so guys let's get started on this on this window Every little thing you do Every time you hold me, take me high 
this is how, what do you guys think? This is how the curtain is looking with the share one as the, I guess, when you want lighting. And as you guys can see, I put the rods too far, the holes for the hooks for the rods too far apart. So I had to bring them back in because the rods actually say that they are uh, 210, 2 meters and 10, 210 meters. And uh, I did it to actually 200 meters. So that's not true. The rods are not uh, 200 meters long so i had to bring them back in and that is why y'all see those holes over there but my idea is to hook this together and just give it like a kind of to look for when I want sunlight and yeah I only have to go in and take down like the tags because those tags are bothering me and I have to bring the rods in even to each other because they're bothering me as well but yeah that's about it but I like it put the other one in. I want to let y'all know this is long. These are long. Let me bring y'all closer. Let me bring y'all closer because this is long. Okay, y'all see how bunched up that is on the ground? Like these are super, super, super long. So I'm going to have to fix that. And that's the reason why I bought this hem tape. Because I knew that it would be too long. So I'm going to work on that probably a little later, no more for the day, because I have to go ahead and start dinner. But, you know, I'm liking how it's looking. Yeah. Now, if only I could find a bed set that matches the curtain, because it's an off-white, and I really like how that creamy off-white looks. Yeah. So y'all can see my my errors <laughs> but yeah i'm gonna have to go and buy some sparkle and fill that in a little later but yep i'm happy guys finally got some curtains hey beauties i forgot to record an outro so i'm just showing you guys how the curtain looks with the window open and i must say i love how this looks so i just want to thank you guys for watching this video if you did enjoy it please give me a big thumbs up as well as subscribe if you have not as yet the patio makeover is coming i promise guys i'm going to try to get that out for you guys next week so definitely stay tuned for that and i will see you guys in the next one so as always peace and love until next time